Rock the hell shy. Yeah, I was just uh, listening to um, to the Bible in the Book of Acts um, around the time when uh, Paul and Silas first uh, parted ways, and uh, not too long after that, uh, the Apostle Paul had got arrested. I believe it was with Silas, and um, as they were arrested in the prison they were um, praising the Lord and um, you know I believe there was like some sort of earthquake or something happened where the, the uh, all the prison doors were opened up and the uh, the guard of the prison house which was a Jake he was about to he pulled his sword out he was about to kill himself and then uh, Paul told him you know not to hurt himself because all the prisoners were still there and uh, he asked for a light. And the uh, prison guard came in with the light, trembling. And um, when he came in with the light, trembling, he asked Paul and, and Silas and them, "What could I do to, to be saved?" You know. And Paul and Barnabas told him, or well, Paul actually told him, "All you have to do is believe in Yahweh Shai, and you shall be saved." So from that point on, you know. That, that particular uh, guard, he was delivered, he was saved. And, um, you know, it just made me think of how, how simple it is. How, this truth is very simple. You know, it's not complicated at all. Like it tells you in the book of Proverbs, the eighth chapter, it's plain to them that have understanding, you know? So it's very, very easy to understand. But at the same time, when I thought, when I, when I, you know, when I heard that, I thought about that it's that easy. All you have to do really is believe that Yahweh Shai is the Messiah, and you, and just that deed alone can deliver you and save you. But the thing is that you have to be a part of the elect in order to uh, be able to believe, and in, in order to be delivered. So that it just made me think of how precious, you know, this, this, this truth really is, you know, when you have the full understanding of, of everything, because these, these people in the church, they'll say that, that, you know, you can be saved, all you have to do is believe in, in Jesus, they call him Jesus, his name is Yahweh Shai, and, you know, technically, what they're saying is true, but they don't know who to apply it to, it's only applied to the elect. So it's a very simple task and a very simple deed to do, to, to, uh, to be delivered. But the thing about it is that, that the, the, the uh, average person out there doesn't understand is you have to be a part of the elect in order to believe, in order to be saved, you know? So as I was listening to it, it, it you know, just inspired me just to, uh, uh, you know, film something real quick. You know, to uh, uh, put that message or commit that message down to video, you know, um, and share that, you know, with, with brothers, because when when you when you when you're dealing with the scriptures, when you're dealing with the with the truth, a lot of uh, people out there try to make the truth a whole lot more complicated than what it is, because they can't believe it's that easy to understand the truth and 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 to be delivered but the thing is that they don't as easy as it is to to uh, be delivered you also have to be a part of the elect and and that's a great thing man a great thing to understand you know and um, you know like I said I just thought I just thought about it you know and I wanted just to record it you know to uh, to share with you brothers um, that that you know that that's heavy you know the point you know it, i mean we it's, these are things that we know but every once in a while when things are isolated you know an instance is isolated or you hear something or you hear a brother read a scripture it just brings it more to life you know and it gives it a, a broader perspective uh, of what it's dealing with you know so like i said the truth is simple all you have to do is believe in yahweh shai yahweh bashem yahweh shai and you will be delivered, but you have to be, first and foremost, you have to be an Israelite. And second of all, you have to be a part of the elect. You know, so with that, you know, I hope you brothers have been edified to the next time I say Shalom.